Stevenson gets the 101-71 win over Widener here today at Owings Mills Gymnasium. Glenn Clark with Coach Gary Stewart. Coach, it's not just that your team beat a good Widener team and beat them by a sizable margin to me. It's that you did it while playing without some of your regulars and having other guys get hurt during the course of the game. Are we really starting to see what your team is capable of at this point? Well, I hope so. Yeah, it, it's coming together. We've had a good week, and um, the guys are buying into what we're trying to do. And, um, you know, we're in Maryland, so it's next man up, and, and hopefully we'll get a couple of these guys back. You know, we, we talked last Saturday after a tough loss, and you were really disappointed in your team. What do you think they took from that game and that effort that maybe has – perhaps turn things around in the week that's followed? Well, a lot of that was on me. Uh, you know, we, we didn't prepare very well. We didn't prepare very well on, on Thursday and, and Friday. And, and so I, it was a lesson for all of us, not just, just uh, our, our guys. And, and I thought we had better preparation and, and our intensity and attention to detail was much better. And, um, and we were able to uh, take that into the floor and execute better. You know, we talk about some of the things your team has been through injury-wise, but the value and the guys that are getting in there and giving you minutes. And, you know, we talked about Bo Wesley a lot, who was pressed in early on in the season, and now you're able to put him in there and he's able to do some nice things for you. Yeah, we're, we're um, defense first, and he's a guy that um, can block shots in the interior, big, strong guy, and, and he keeps playing better and better in practice, as do all of our freshmen. Um, so we're not afraid to play those guys. Um, they've gotten a lot better, and, um, and we're going to need them. And then how about in that final minute to have Damon hit the three there, rattles around, hits everything, and then Drew Miller to get a basket well at the end. I know that's got to mean everything for the whole program. You can see what it does for the entire team. Yeah, you can tell um, by how much our guys root for those guys, um, how connected we are. And, uh, again, they're good players. You know, we were real excited about our freshmen. Um, uh, Damon is an excellent shooter and also good on the interior. And uh, Drew is a physical, big, strong rascal down there and, and uh, got good hands. And so, um, um, you know, from a coaching standpoint, I was really pleased with the execution. You know, we, we didn't um, take bad shots at the end. We, we got what we wanted, and, and those guys capitalized. The importance of not getting complacent, right? Like you get a big win over a good team. You maybe start feeling good about yourself. You still have work to do. you got to go right back out on the road on Wednesday and play at Hood. Yeah, I don't think we'll get complacent. I think we're, we're excited about uh, the, where we're headed and the direction of our program. And, and we also know and recognize that we've got things uh, to improve and things that we can get better at. Well, Coach, congratulations on a great win today, and best of luck as you head back out on the road this week. Thank you, Glenn. He's Coach Gary Stewart. I'm Glenn Clark for GoMustangSports.com.